So today I'm talking about a P0406 code, what it is and how you go about fixing it. And so what is a P0406 code? Well, it's an exhaust gas recirculation sensor A circuit high. And what does this mean? Well, basically vehicles have what's called an EGR valve, and this is for emissions. The way the EGR valve works is that some of the exhaust gases are gonna get fed back around to the EGR valve, which is gonna be controlled by the computer and it's gonna feed exhaust gases back into the intake so that some of the exhaust gas goes into the combustion chambers. And this helps to lower the engine combustion temperature, which also reduces nitrogen oxide, which helps to reduce emissions. But when you get a P0406 code, the computer's seeing some kind of problem with this EGR valve, mainly inside of the circuit going to the EGR valve. And so it's gonna to have to be troubleshooted to know why. And so what are some possible causes of a P0406 code? Well, the first thing that could cause this is that that EGR valve's just gone bad. It's just failed and it just needs to be replaced. It is very common for these to get clogged up from all those exhaust gases that's going through it. They get clogged up along with the passages going back up into the engine and different things like this. And quite often that causes problems. So a lot of people, when they get EGR valve codes, they automatically take it off and then they'll clean it up. After they clean it up, they'll put it back on. And quite commonly that works. But with this code, it's saying sensor A circuit high. So this is pointing more to the wiring or the circuit, which can also be the electronics on the EGR valve. So while you could take it off and you could clean it up and put it back on, very likely that won't help if the EGR valve has gone bad because most likely it's going to be in the electronics on the EGR valve. But the first thing that could cause this is a bad EGR valve. And the next thing that could cause this is the wiring going to the EGR valve. Basically, if there's any kind of problem in the wiring, like an open, a short, a bad connection, something like this, then that's going to cause problems. If you do go to work on your vehicle, you will need to get a wiring diagram for your specific vehicle, since there will be differences on what's going on with the wiring, the different things along these lines. But if you could get a wiring schematic for your particular vehicle, you can get a multimeter and go through and test that wiring and be sure that you got the right voltages, good grounds. There's no opens or shorts or anything like this, because the next thing that could cause this is some kind of wiring issue. The next thing that could cause this is a bad sensor. Basically, there might not be no problem inside of the system, but the computer thinks there is because there's a bad sensor reporting bad information back to the computer. And it could vary and depend on the vehicle, which sensor the computer's using. And these type of sensors are going to be like the differential pressure feedback sensor or like a manifold absolute pressure sensor, something along those lines. Again, it will vary. It will depend on the vehicle, the year, different things like this, on what sensors the computer's using with that EGR valve. So you will need to do a little bit of research. But the next thing that could cause this is a bad sensor. And so that's basically it. I just wanted to give a basic overview of how you go about fixing a vehicle with the P0406 code. If you have anything to add, please comment down below. If you have any questions, ask me and I'll try to answer them. If this video helps you. Please click like, please click subscribe and have a good day.